What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So, first thing I want to do is... What is this? Discarded Umbrella. Whoa. <laughs> Wait, what? Damage 0.5, range 2.5. Okay, so it's, a, it's just a, it's a joke weapon. It's a joke weapon. We're not going to use the umbrella. Now we are, however, going to go get some upgrades. So 600. Damn, I'm actually really close to the second strength upgrade. Maybe I just wait. If we're that close, I'm going to wait. So hang on one second. I'm going to... Well, no. Decided to close some window I left open. Up down there, too. Oh, I need to break through that wall to get it. Okay. Alright, well, no, you know what? No. No, no, no. I know we're close, but we came all the way over here. Let's get an upgrade. Let's do, um... So, strength and speed. Quality build. So we got to go up a little bit, and then we're going to check out the stuff that is over to the, uh, let's just say, let's say west. I don't know the actual headings here, but you know, it's that direction. Pop shots there, though. Family tune. Gotta be, there's some puzzle here. I think I need to break them all before they. magic spell or something. I don't know. We're gonna leave that for now. Can't bust that open. Unless it's the umbrella, like, secretly... So there's really nothing over here. Just that, that first zone. 
Well, in that case, I guess in we go. Hopefully we get some kind of special ability from the witch. this living reaper I hunger for souls ancient door spirit uh, okay so I need a key this place is confusing. So he hungers for souls. Oh, here we go. Is this like a... Uh... There he is. Tricky. There's a key there. I did like a uh, like a ground slam or something. You look shady. Are these pots all different. Oh wait, what is? That's, hmm. Did that light up when I killed that pot? I'm gonna get four pots for a puzzle door? I do, okay. I like blue urns, four blue urns.
don't think we're hurting him at all. Oh, I gotta break the plates open. The creepy boss, or elite, or whatever you want to call it. I can redirect that. I gotta get to get that thing open. There's gotta be like a shortcut that unlocks for me to get back. Yeah, I just heard something unlock. Who are you? Is that the witch? key and there's a door there there's also this door and was there another one or is it just those two Reminds me a lot of the uh, the witch from Spirited Away. That was an easy key compared to the first one. fight through rooms that I finished. like a shadow realm. Oh, wow. 
What does this do? I was just randomly hitting the button. Talk about some like seriously dumb luck. Magical capacity beyond its limits. What does that do though? I still don't, unless is my arrow considered magic? Now I'm like paranoid and looking at the floor. I need more, more uh, health. I just need a higher health pool. I keep getting bopped. Okay. Let me um. Let me see what was that other way first, just to to check it, because I didn't look that way at all. So let's see what's down here. come here and I would have had my own elevator. See. Shall we dance? Oh shit. I got one health. Jeez, thing was not easy. It's so hard. It was hard to dodge, too. That's what I did. So if you attack when you're falling, it must have been a glitch before.
No, oh my god, I'm really bad at this. Go this way. here. An old engagement ring. Now you need to find someone who wants to marry you. Um, yeah. I, sh I mean, it's a weird spot to put one, but... Maybe this is a uh, a Dark Souls thing. It's like cut the cut the chandelier, have it collapse type deal. Yep. That is it indeed. Since I already got a little bit of speed, I may actually focus on just like maxing out strength and then doing like max strength with the daggers. I feel like that would be a super potent combination. more than Dark Souls. Swarmed. All right, I need the sword here. I think I need the wider. the wide, The wider swing is gonna be. There's just too much, too much bullshit. And that 2.5 range will make a big difference here. I think. I'm gonna guess there's gonna be a. So we got daggers. We got sword. There's obviously gonna be a heavy weapon, like a great sword or something. And then for the last one, maybe a spear. Maybe something that's slightly less damage, but like super long range. Go more of this shit. Come here. Give me all of your single souls. ladder for lighting them all and actual ladder for progression hey. I almost got enough for my next upgrade Free 
get the bird? Exit it out. Yes, indeed. Oh, that's a good spot to have a seat. So I'm going to guess that the other part of this area will get us... Uh, will get us the third soul and the key, and then we can go and get the final soul from the top door. No, wait, I have the key. I already have the key. So we just gotta go back to fight uh, Mr. Tongue. from getting my ass beat to a flawless victory. Ghost number three, you're coming home with me. I'm thinking we're at 28 minutes, but I'm like, there's one more door. Should I just push? Well, though, I bet we're going to have some kind of encounter with the witch in the next part. Like a, a boss fight type deal. If it's like the four souls are so they're somehow imprisoned and that's what allows her to continue living is like they they basically sacrifice themselves to be in like purgatory forever but unwillingly This one doesn't look that long. We'll, we'll push on real fast, because I don't have... Uh, I'm about to go out anyway to the gym, so I don't have enough time to, like, jump right into the next episode regardless. So it's like, eh, why not? Let's, just... Let's try and get it done now.
lever. Here we go. That's the key. Key isn't what I mean. It's this guy. Oh, I do need the key. I need both. Get the key. And then we'll go this way. No oh my god. <laughs> I'm so bad at this, man. This is one of the reasons I like, I don't usually play like 3D platformers, which this isn't a 3D platformer. Um, but, you know, that, that, uh, making sure you're on the right path on an isometric view. When you can like jump and stuff, it always it messes me up. I don't know what's waiting for me, so let's heal up. Mr. Tongue in round three. easier focusing on him since they teleport all over. You said I would live forever, but with a pot for a head, no thanks. Yup, yup, they were imprisoned for sure. Their, their souls were imprisoned, and they all became potheads. It's weird using that term without referring to... You know, it's so synonymous with somebody that just gets baked all the time. Lock for a head, so strange. Beach ass, old lady. Fastest way out of here. Lock with a head. I don't know if I remember anyone that has a lock or a head. Um, yeah, but either way, we're going to wrap things up here, though. Uh, I got 600, which means we are definitely going back to base and leveling up. Let me go look real fast. Like, lock with a head. Is that the main guy? Is that the, the dude that levels me up? I don't think so. I mean, it's a little bit hard to tell with grayscale. This guy's new. Looks more like a bug. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll have to keep our eyes out for Lockhead, but for now at least, we are going to wrap things up. So we'll have more coming your way tomorrow. Stay tuned, and I'll see you all then with more Death Store.